The circle is nature's shape. Indigenous knowledge says everything tries to become round. Clouds, river stones, trees, wind currents, raindrops, planets, galaxies, solar systems are all round. Indigenous knowledge also says that if we can observe the natural world and if we can emulate nature, then we too can make a fair and successful living. An elder once said, all your answers, everything you will ever need to know to lead a good, honest life is in the natural world around you. So our people observe the animals, birds, turtles, beavers, and ants and recognize that they all make their living inside a circle. All of these animals are self-sufficient. A tiny songbird builds its nest and raises its family inside a round home. A songbird weighs just a few ounces, and yet it doesn't need one dollar to survive a harsh North Dakota winter. Nature provides a model for success. For thousands of years throughout the history of human evolution, indigenous populations worldwide have built round homes modeled after the natural environment. Energy flows in a circle and creates circulation. There are no edges for strong winds to catch on a round home. The roof line sheds water without corners for the moisture to settle in. There are many testimonies of people entering a round home and saying they can feel the energy flowing inside. Heat and air circulate and radiate evenly inside a uniform circle. Black Elk said that when the government moved us into gray square boxes, that our people began to become sick. The Livingstone Lodge is designed and modeled from a traditional Mandan, Hiratsa, and Arikara style earth lodge home. It is said the beavers and the ants taught us how to build our homes. Both are industrious and family oriented. Beavers make a round den with a breathe hole on top, and so do the ants. By following nature's design, we can once again have strong, healthy, and vibrant families and become self-sufficient too. Livingstone Lodge Home. We believe we can do better. What if our homes could be built in a way that they would be more durable to last longer, provide a safe shelter to withstand storms, cost very little to heat, be healthier to live in, and affordable to build? With these goals in mind, we have begun a journey to design and build the Livingstone Lodge Homes. The Livingstone Lodge Home was designed to easily withstand temperatures of minus 50 degrees to 100 degrees plus. One of the most important design features is the round shape. It requires less exterior walls for the same amount of interior space than other designs. The circular design creates the best airflow for heating, cooling, and ventilation. An energy recovery ventilator sends stale air out of the home while bringing fresh air into the home and controlling the humidity. The Livingstone Lodge design works by connecting the home to the ground. Using the thermal mass of the Earth's ground temperature, it will require less energy to heat or cool the space. The large triple pane windows are awning and casement style, using a three-piece outside seal to reduce air leakage. The window coatings allow the sun's energy to heat the concrete floor during the day. The heat stored in the floor during the day travels back into the home to keep it warm at night. To add to the heating gain from the sun's energy to the concrete floor, a small gas boiler is used to produce hot water that circulates and warms the floor on those cold or cloudy days. The boiler room is located in the center of the home and surrounded by the kitchen, laundry, and bathrooms. This allows all of the heat energy created by appliances and hot water to be captured within the home. The walls are constructed with insulated concrete forms, ICF, 
to provide an R30 insulation value and work a lot like a thermos bottle, keeping the warm in and the cold outside. The core of the ICF wall is formed with six inches of solid concrete, creating a disaster resistant building. The roof panels are a structurally insulated panel system known as SIPs and provide an R40 plus insulation value. They are easy to install and become an airtight system when properly sealed to the top of the ICF walls. The roof and walls work together in compression and tension so that no interior walls are required for support. Once the roof is assembled, it is self-supporting and this allows for the design of any floor plan within the building envelope. The large skylight provides natural lighting for the 600 square foot open loft. We added the loft to replace the basement and remove the potential for mold and toxic air quality. The entryway acts as an airlock and keeps hot or cold air from entering the home, which lowers the energy costs. We hope you will come and share your experiences with us as we share our journey with you and together let's change the way we build on our reservations and create better housing projects in the future.